We're going to continue our chat with West Side Stories' Ansel Elgort on location at his childhood theater camp. And he's about to show us around. But first, he's going to show me some moves. And then it goes a little something like this. Take a look. Will you show me around your school? Yeah, I have to show you something first, though, while we're here. Show okay, me so first. These red ladders. This is part of the Our Time Cabaret. The Our Time Cabaret was like the ultimate honor. If you were in the Our Time Cabaret, it meant that you could sing, you could dance, and you clearly loved performing. I have to show you the dance from Our Time Cabaret. This is the famous dance. It's called What a Country. Okay, okay. so like you lift one foot and you, sh and you shuffle the other, so like. Do you like how like the other leg just won't get up right now? <laughs> I'm like, okay. Yeah, and now we go to the right. And now we go twice to the left. Um, oh! <laughs> did I tell you or did I tell you? I can't be cool. Okay, okay. By the yeah. way, you just met the real me. <laughs> Make your funniest face. That's your funniest face. No. <laughs> there we go. Okay, yours. <laughs> yeah, you've done more comedy than you would. You're the dancer, I'm the court jester. <laughs> but there's a place for both of us. Where should we go? We'll just take a walk around the camp, right? So Natalie Portman went here. Sick. Robert Downey Jr. Yeah. Uh, Beanie Feldstein. Yep. Love yeah, we her. were we were in the cabaret together. We were doing that dance together. Wow, I love this room. I love this place. This was the boys' dormitory. Can you guess what the name is? What is it? It's called Barrymore. <laughs> Don't play with me. It's serious, it's called Barrymore. <laughs> and I never put the, even the two, the two together, but it's actually, apparently, it's named after you. <laughs> Isn't that nuts? That's crazy, right? But there's no girls allowed in Barrymore, so you're not allowed to go inside. Oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god! I mean, I'm sorry, but like the Steven connection and the fact that you were in Barrymore. <laughs> Isn't that nuts? And we're here together. This was the first stage that I was on here. Um, I was in uh, Once Upon a Mattress and Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat. Yes. And it was called The Kitty Show. Because, the Kitty? Yeah, because when you were, the, the, this show had kids playing leads. Then when you got to the other theaters, if you were like 11 years old, you wouldn't play lead, usually. So how old are you here? 11 and 12. And then when you're 12, you go over there and you do your West Side Story on that stage. Yes, so okay. that was my first show out of the Kitty show. How did you meet Violetta? Which, by the way, just sounds so Shakespearean and perfect. Where did you I guys meet? I know the most meet? beautiful name ever, right? It is. Um, we met in high school. So, wait. God, how long have you been dating? Uh, Almost 10 years? Yeah, we've known each other for 10 years. I love this. How does that not become a rock in your life? How's that not so such a grounding force? I mean, no, is it a grounding force? Definitely, yeah. So what does she say if you get, like, ego-y? Yeah, she definitely keeps it real with me. She's tough on me. That's good. That is good. <laughs> Look at this office. Wow. Oh, my God. I, oh. Like, I remember, like, all these people. Why don't we do headshots anymore, Ansel? Whoa. Remember we used to go to, like, dry cleaners and diners, and there were headshots everywhere? Wow. We used to have an epic ping pong rivalry, me and Brian. You did? Mm-hmm. Who won? Uh, you know, it was pretty even. That's why it was a good rivalry. Oh, look, there I am. My dad took that photo. By the way, that's your Ann Solo, like, on Spotify picture. Oh. Your dad took that? Yep. We took it, yeah, in Brooklyn when I was like uh, maybe t 20. At nighttime, you had kind of like free time. You could kind of just roam around, and all the rooms were open. See, they had pianos in every room. So I'd come and play piano, sing. I heard you say that you wish you could be like Prince, so you could just pick up any instrument and play it. Yeah, I'm, you know, but that's, it's, he worked on that for sure. This we used to tap dance in here. It's good sound. Good light, right? This, yeah, this was a makeup room. This is the ultimate perfect last question. Should I, would you recommend it to, to other kids to come here? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm very grateful for my time here and I have all good memories, even the, 
you know, rejection and all that kind of stuff. It's like, it all sets you up for real life. And even if you don't get the role you want, you make it work and you put your heart and soul into it. And all the people you meet here and everyone is so passionate and yeah, so I definitely recommend it. I love coming here. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, Ansel, my goodness. West Side Story is in theaters this Friday, December 10th. And may I just say, that this is so much more than a film. It is the humanity and the revelation and the coming together that we all need. I can't wait for everyone to see it.